We all know that XRP has been delisted by Coinbase due to the lawsuit filed by the SEC for almost a year now. Did you know, however, that it is slated to be relisted soon on Coinbase? Welcome to Crypto Live. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on our upcoming videos about cryptocurrencies. Coinbase, one of the largest cryptocurrency exchanges, is said to be relisting XRP among its trading pairs in a major way. Ripple Labs Inc. has teamed up with a nonprofit to create and implement a way for the UK's Central Bank Digital Currency, or CBDC for short. This new partnership bolsters the crypto firm's ongoing efforts to engage with general central banks on policy and high-tech problems connected to the creation of the CBDC in a sort of major way. XRP is a unique financial asset that combines the greatest features of traditional investments with the security of a generally stable coin and the use cases of several of the world's most popular decentralized currencies, such as XRP. The continuing legal battle between the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission and Ripple Labs Inc. over the status of XRP, which generally resulted in major exchanges delisting the Ripple currency, has given the Ripple asset a lot more exposure since then. For the most part, XRP fans all over the world have gone on a Twitter frenzy, demanding that CBDC, the banker's favorite and the World Economic Forum's most relevant crypto asset for the world, be relisted on this one of the largest exchanges, which is quite significant. Furthermore, the US SEC essentially appears to be on the losing end of the game right now, as Ripple continues to rack up impressive wins while the litigation goes on subtly. The SEC mostly said that Ripple Coin was being sold as a security asset, which made the Ripple team a lot of money, but that such a feature also automatically registered the XRP token as a security asset, or so they thought for the most part. However, it essentially was not registered as such with the commission before the predetermined sales. Given the similarity between these crypto platforms, more on the token generation events, and then, the SEC filed a lawsuit complaint against Ripple Labs Inc., which is quite significant to the investors, to other U.S. government officials, and even to the lawyers such as Attorney Jeremy Hogan. The defendants have come to essentially contend that if XRP was a security token, then other cryptocurrencies such as Ethereum and even Bitcoin should be considered as well. Additionally, it is very evident that the suit's after-effects almost severed Ripple and its very native XRP asset, which others think the company would be unable to recover. Meanwhile, we all know that despite all of this and rumors circulating about Ripple Labs Inc. receiving a lawsuit from the SEC, the fintech industry has gained. Fortunately, a significant amount of attention from key financial stakeholders, a credit that resulted in significant price increase for the Ripple Asset XRP in a subtle way, and now as the movement for the relisting of XRP on these prominent exchanges gains traction, Coinbase has indicated that it would particularly relist XRP. With that thousand-year time potential, we could easily see XRP's price will skyrocket very soon once it is being listed in Coinbase. Additionally, almost every major cryptocurrency exchange site has been seen making massive XRP token transfers, both externally and between internal wallet addresses. Furthermore, Coinbase continues to generally enable traders to huddle or transfer their XRP assets, while also implying that the XRP cryptocurrency may, for the most part, be relisted among its trading pairs soon following the SEC's decision. In addition to that, the SEC recently threatened to prosecute a crypto trading platform located in the United States for establishing a new loan service on its website, or so they mostly thought. Brian Armstrong, the CEO of Coinbase, maintains that the new feature mostly is nothing more than a foreign revenue stream that guarantees investors a 4% interest rate on their investments, notably those who own stablecoin. Financial regulatory watchdogs in the United States, on the other hand, literally do not appear to be on board with that approach, or so they thought. The commission, for the most part, had previously classified the fairly high-yield product as a security, which has piqued the interest of millions of crypto fans who like the process of receiving a return on their investments, which is quite significant. Coinbase has been in proactive negotiations with the SEC for the last six months about implementing the Lend option on its platform, with the product expected to be live in June 2022. 
Since then, the exchange platform situated in the United States has been hoping for a thorough explanation as to why the regulatory agency declined them to enable to do so, but to no avail. As a result, the Yield product, which was created by Coinbase to reward loyal users while also providing them with greater financial empowerment, literally has long served as a wake-up, essentially call for the SEC to stretch its muscles once kind of more in a big way. However, it seems that the SEC particularly has been attempting to prevent Coinbase from launching this product. In light of the Ripple case and the potential for Coinbase relisting, most crypto enthusiasts, including Coinbase's CEO, Brian Armstrong, have questioned the SEC's approach, which is quite significant. So Coinbase, which is essentially had previously delisted XRP in response to the SEC's complaint against Ripple Labs, now appears to be siding with the crypto remittance business. For the most part, the SEC threatening to generally sue Coinbase unless it has a clear grasp of the legislative framework essentially uses to designate digital services or securities or not. Also, it's understandable why the Brian Armstrong-led team would, for the most part, want to relist the XRP coin on its platform, which is fairly significant. Coinbase's CEO expressed dissatisfaction with the SEC's denial of a service that numerous crypto firms in and outside the state provided a major way. In the continuing dispute, the Coinbase CEO kind of went ahead and expressed his support for Ripple. So, given the Coinbase's prominence in the U.S. financial industry and the fact that it just ranked number one in the App Store, ahead of Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, Facebook, and even YouTube, you should start paying attention to what the CEO has to say. Senators Elizabeth Warren and Pat Toomey, in particular, have been vocal in their condemnation of the SEC's actions in the cryptocurrency business. Despite Coinbase's outright refusal, members of the XRP community have continued to utilize the hashtag relist XRP on the exchange, which is reasonable given that the present regulatory uncertainties in the U.S. crypto industry. Also, since the SEC was designed to safeguard investors and promote a level playing field for both investors and financial businesses, we may claim that it has failed miserably in this respect. This is definitely because it's difficult to generally tell who's being protected and who is in danger, mainly due to the regulators' muddled regulatory enforcement. Furthermore, investors specifically appear to be mostly pleased with the announcement of the land feature, which allows them to receive a return on such investments. Ripple may be able to help through its payment mechanism, or so they believe, and the XRP ledger is known for swiftly and safely validating transactions in a major way. Because the leading cryptocurrency trading site essentially appears to have already delisted the Ripple coin, it essentially now is trying to relist it, which is usually quite significant. Just as it was recently discovered to have changed the position of XRP among the Coinbase platform's spot trading pairings, despite all of this, the SEC lawsuit has been the key driver for the price of XRP to increase significantly from 2021 to the present in a fairly major way. Also, despite the legal struggle, the digital asset continues to essentially outperform all kinds of other crypto assets and maintain its positions as the sixth most valuable cryptocurrency. When the SEC litigation is resolved and the exchanges like Coinbase relist XRP, the whales will be looking to invest in this cryptocurrency. This would be the initial impetus for the price of the currency to skyrocket, and as additional investors mostly join in, the value would continue to rise. That's all for this video about crypto, and thank you for watching. If you would like to receive updates on the crypto market, make sure you click the subscribe and bell button.